Vancomycin intermediate and vancomycin resistant Staphylococcus aureus are specific types of antimicrobial resistant bacteria. They are considered a healthcare associated infection. People who develop this type of staph infection may have underlying health conditions, tubes going into their bodies, previous infections with methicillin resistant Staphylococcus aureus, and recent exposure to vancomycin and other antimicrobial agents. Staphylococcus aureus is a bacterium commonly found on the skin and in the nose of about 30% of individuals. Most of the time, staph does not cause any harm. These infections can look like pimples, boils, or other skin conditions, and most are able to be treated. Sometimes staph bacteria can get into the bloodstream and cause serious infections which can be fatal. They include the following. Bacteremia or sepsis, when bacteria spread to the bloodstream usually as a result of using catheters or having surgery. Pneumonia, which predominantly affects people with underlying lung disease, including those on mechanical ventilators. Endocarditis, which can lead to heart failure. And bone infections, which can be caused by staph bacteria traveling in the bloodstream or put there by direct contact, such as following trauma. As with all staph bacteria, their spread typically occurs among people having close physical contact with infected patients or contaminated material, such as bandages. People having close physical contact with infected patients while they are outside of the healthcare setting should keep their hands clean by washing thoroughly with soap and water and avoid contact with other people's wounds or material contaminated from wounds. To learn more about vancomycin intermediate and vancomycin resistant Staphylococcus aureus or other health and safety, environmental, infectious disease, or indoor air quality issues, please visit the website shown on the screen. IAQ-TV, the place to be.